You know bowling, right? That game where you awkwardly shove your fingers into a heavy ball, roll it down a lane, and hope to knock over some pins? Well, imagine if this familiar game turned it into a chaotic nightmare. Yep, in Sport Devil, those innocent pins are out for a revenge. In Spider Devil, you are dropped into a round arena with nothing but your trusty bowling ball. Sounds chill, right? Not for long. Soon, bowling pins start spawning all around you, but instead of waiting to be knocked over, they bouncing and charging straight for you. Your job, throw that ball, take them out and try to survive as long as possible. But here's the catch, as you knock down pins, more powerful versions show up and before you know it, you are drawing in an ocean of deadly pins. You know, true nightmare. There is no deep story here, it's all about high scores and chaotic fan. If you knew someone who is obsessed with bowling, Spar Devil is basically their worst nightmare, a never ending army of pins seeking revenge for all the strikes they have endured over the years. You know how warriors dream of glorious death on battlefield? Well, this is like Valhalla for bowlers, where the most epic showdown happens between you and this ruthless pin. Only here the glory is in how long you can last. You start in the center of a round arena and with seconds the first wave of bowling pins pound. They don't walk or roll, they hop towards you. They pause for a second between jumps, giving you just enough time to charge up a shot and take them down. If you knock down the whole group in one throw, you score a strike. Strike not only give you a big point boost, but also unlock lightning shots, which lets you launch a super powered throw that can clear a bunch of pins at once in form of laser. So in this bowling shooter as the game progress, more and more enemies appear. And it's not just regular pins. Pretty soon you are dodging things like circus cannons, dynamite sticks and even UFO and rocket pins that chase you around the arena. The longer you survive, the crazier it gets. Quick stop if you are into indie games or want to see more of the hidden gems I cover. Don't forget to subscribe for more. Now back to the video. I played Spur Devil on both Steam Deck and PC and there's definitely a difference in how the game feels. On PC, aiming was smoother and I found myself hitting higher scores faster because of how precise it could be. On Steam Deck the controls were a bit tougher, but after tweaking the sensitivity settings it became pretty enjoyable. Interestingly, the game adjusts its difficulty based on your score. On PC I was hitting higher scores quicker, which made more challenging enemies spawn faster. Meanwhile, on the Steam Deck I lasted longer before things got hectic, which made the experience feel a a little diff. Still, both versions on the game run well, and Spar Devil is, is perfect for quick, chaotic sessions, especially on the go. Your main weapon is, of course, your bowling ball. You can charge it by holding the button to launch a stronger throw. If you are moving while you are throw, the ball curves, which is great for tricky shots. But if you want a straight shot, you will need to stop for a second before releasing it. Knocking down a full set of pins gives you the chance for bonus points and that all important laser shot. What's cool is that you can also jump on enemies' heads, like in Mario, to take them down. And if you are feeling fancy, you can combine jumps with charged shot or laser for more devastating attack. There's even a kind of rocket jump move. If you charge the ball and throw it beneath you, while in meteor it launches you higher. This little mechanics give the game more depth than you'd expect from a single bowling inspired game. Visually, Spar Devil embraces a retro 3D look with a simple but effective design. The environment and character aren't super detailed, but they fit the game fast paced chaotic vibe. The arena is small, but it's functional and keeps the focus on action rather than flashy graphics. You are not paying for modern, let's say, quadruple A visuals. The music and sound effects are solid, the background tunes match the on screen chaos pretty well, though after a while the music just fades into the background noise. It's not bad, but it's not something you will be having afterward either. Thankfully, if you are not a fan of the soundtrack, you can turn off with a missing match. Sport Devil is kind of game that will either hook you or wear you out, depending on how you match enjoy chasing high scores. For me it's fun in short bursts, but after a few rounds the gameplay can start feeling repetitive. It's one of these easy to learn, hard to master games. I enjoy unlocking different skins for my bowling ball, which you can earn by completing challenges like defeating certain enemies or holding an S rank for over a minute, which is way hard on Steam Deck by the way. That said, the lack of variety in arenas and enemies might limit its appeal in the long run. There are two 
modes, Standard and Time Attack, where you race against the clock. But beyond that, I found myself wanting more new arenas, new enemies or additional game modes to keep things fresh. If the concept of Spark Devil intrigues you, definitely give it a shot. It's chaotic, fun and the perfect game for quick adrenaline fueled sessions. And if you want more videos on quirky indie games and cool projects, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and catch you next time.